Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a Q&A, questions and answers, which I love doing videos like this because I just love interacting with you guys and answering your questions and seeing what you guys want to know about me. I'm really out of breath because it's super hot in my room and it's super hot today, but I don't have AC in here and if the AC, if my, sorry, if my fan was on, it'd be really loud, so I'm not going to put it on. So let's start with Instagram first. It's loading. <laughs> if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, my Instagram is at SabrinaVaz123. Any other account, it's not me, it's fake, so don't follow it. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is cute. What make you plan your okay, what made you plan your own um, bikini brand? So if you guys didn't know, I own Bina Beachwear, which is my um, bikini company. It's a bikini swim line company. And um with the help of my dad, I started it, and um, what made me start it, I guess I just, I love styling bikinis, and bikinis were always something that I never had enough of, because I always wanted, like, a certain style, but I never, like, had it out there, so I pretty much just made the style for myself, what I wanted, and we decided to make a bunch of them, and sell them. <laughs> my throat just started hurting, I don't know why, I guess I'm talking too much today. Um, will you marry your boyfriend? Um... I don't know, we'll see. Um, we've been together for almost two years, so I don't know. I do love him though, so okay. What would be, this is Morgan, thanks Morgan for the question, what would be your ultimate vacation? Mmm, that's a great question. Honestly, I love tropical, I think tropical vacations are probably my favorite, but Europe is very amazing. I've been to Portugal and Europe ha like has a place in my heart. But I'm going to say somewhere tropical, maybe like Fiji or like Bora Bora, like on those little island hut things. I think that would be so romantic and so beautiful. Would you rather live in New York City or Los Angeles? This isn't really much of a question for me. It's straight up Los Angeles. I've been to both places before and I only went to New York in the winter, so maybe that's why I was didn't like it as much. But it was super, super cold and it was nice and a lot, a lot of people, maybe too much people, but... It was nice, and I liked it, but not as much as I like California and Los Angeles. Los Angeles is beautiful, and I love everything about it. Okay. How tall are you? Hmm. I'm... I don't know why I was like, hmm, like I know how tall I am. I'm 5'6", and a half-ish. But, like, I just say I'm 5'6", because, I don't know, I guess I'm just 5'6". What languages do you... do you speak? Okay, what languages do you speak? I speak English, but I do know a little bit of Portuguese and a little... No, sorry, not even really Portuguese. More Portuguese, Spanish, and a little bit of French, but not enough to really even say that I speak it. I need to drink really bad. Okay. <laughs> oh, God, that's not even a question. Sorry, I'm trying to find the question not answering that question I literally sent them that's terrible okay uh sorry guys let's get some more here what was your dream job besides being a singer I think just a creator in general I'm I would love to entertain so um anything in the entertainment industry I know sing singing is but it, okay if I couldn't be anything like that then Maybe like owning like a, a restaurant, but not cooking because I can't cook, but like, you know, owning like a low-key like food truck. That'd be kind of cool. Mm. What's your most viewed video on YouTube? So most of the views that I get on YouTube are unfortunately from covers and those aren't my own. But anyway, the most viewed video is Starships by Nicki Minaj and the second most viewed video is Girlfriend by Avril Lavigne. How do you get perfect skin and get rid of body scars and darkness? Mm, my skin is far from per perfect, but thank you so much for saying that. Um, I cleanse morning and night, I exfoliate every other day, make sure to moisturize. Um, how do you get rid of body scars? I do have some body scars and I don't know how to get rid of them. Maybe bio oil, that would be my suggestion. And darkness, um, some maybe like a, a serum, like a vitamin C serum would be good for that. How come we haven't seen any pets in your recent videos? Do you have any now? Um, unfortunately, I don't have any pets right now. 
my dog Pookie passed away, um, I don't know how many years ago, but, uh, it's very sad, and my favorite dog in the whole wide world, and I love Pookie, still think about Pookie to this day, I love Pookie, um, but yeah, most of you guys probably have seen Pookie in, like, later videos, but, uh, yeah, he was pretty ill, so, yeah, he's no longer with us, but I don't have any pets right now, um, my boyfriend does have two dogs, though, and that's plenty enough, um, they're adorable, and they're very sweet, and, I love them a lot. Going to do any meetups in Windsor soon. Okay, so I live in Windsor, if you guys don't know. And, hmm, I don't know, I've never done a meetup before. I feel like they're, they're kind, of, they kind of scare me a little bit. Um, I'm very antisocial. <laughs> no, but I'm not that good in person meeting people. I don't know, I get very shy. I'm kind of awkward. You guys can probably see how awkward I am for my videos, but I'm even more awkward in person. So, if there is a lot of people in Windsor that do want to do a meetup, maybe I could figure something out, but as of, as what I know, as far as far as I know now, I am not doing any meetups in um, Windsor. Would you ever do a meet and greet? Oh, that's nice. People actually want to meet me? Guys, <laughs> that's so sweet, literally. I didn't know people wanted to meet me. I'm emotional today. Why is your hand so big? Oh, okay, that's a different question. That's a weird question, but that's just from what I posted. Um, my hands aren't that big, guys. Sorry. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to Snapchat. Okay, so now I'm on Snapchat looking at some questions. Okay, the first one says, boob job question mark. I don't know. That's such a random question. I don't even think, I don't know what that even means, but, um, if you mean, like, do I have a boob job, then no, <laughs> but like I do have really small boobs and like sometimes when I wear like push-up bras and stuff I guess it could look like I've gotten a boob job, um, because right now like when I don't wear bras I don't look like I have big boobs at all and then like when I do wear bras it looks like my boobs are so big, but um, no I definitely don't have a boob job, but I am kind of like... Like, there, it is, that I did have times before where I've thought about that, and, like, I've been really insecure because, like, you know, like, my boobs aren't big, and, like, I can't really fill out, like, any shirts, and, like, a lot of my bras don't even fit me, so, it, that does kind of suck, but, no, I don't have a boob job, and, um, maybe when I'm, like, older I'll get one, <laughs> I don't know. Another person asked about my dream job, and I think I said owning, like, a food truck or something, but... I really don't know what my dream job would be because it is kind of just like being a singer or like entertainment or like being a creator like this on YouTube so I don't really know how to answer that one. What do you do for a job? <laughs> well, in between like Patreon and selling my bikinis and YouTube it has be become like a little bit of an income for me but I don't live alone. I live with my dad still and um yeah, I don't have any major things to pay off or pay for, so right now I'm just kind of doing everything for fun. What is the top five things on your bucket list? Okay, that's cool. Um, I want to go to either Bora Bora or Fiji for sure, because that's amazing. Um, I want to, I want to hit a million subscribers, which I know I'm quite far away from, but it will happen, people, it will happen. Yeah, have a full album, like a full professionally done album with like 10 songs on it of like my originals. Um, this is a hard question, I gotta say. Maybe go like bungee jumping or something, that'd be kind of cool. I can't even do this with my fingers laying it. So four, one more is meeting Elvis Presley. I know he's dead, but I'm gonna do it <laughs> when I die. What's your favorite food and do you have plans to visit Europe someday? Love you. Oh, that's so sweet. Love you too. Um, my favorite food is pasta, pasta, pasta. I've always said that. If you watch any of my other videos where someone asks me that, it's pasta. <laughs> I love pasta so much and Nutella too. But um, yeah, pa any pasta. Alfredo right now is more. I'm more into that. But I do like spicy like arrabbiata pasta too. Mmm, so, so good. And my favorite fast food is Taco Bell. And I know that's a different question. And you plan to visit Europe? I would love to go back to Europe. I love Europe so much. Mm, my heart 
I left my heart in Europe. That's that was terrible. It's not a song. It's I left my heart in San Francisco. I think, but anyway, yes, I do plan on visiting Europe again. Describe yourself in five words. Hmm. Mm. I don't know. I'm kind of funny. <laughs> I think. And I'm pretty honest. And I'm lazy. And I'm quite friendly, but very shy. Oh, that's good. I got a lot there. Mm -hmm. So, honest. Wait, what was the first one? Honest, lazy, friendly, shy. Funny. Honestly, those are all really great. Like, those are probably... That's me in five, in five uh, words. Okay, here's another question. Who is your favorite artist at the moment? Um... Right now, probably Post Malone. I have Malone Fever. Um... Yeah, right now, probably Post Malone, but, um, that's always a very, very tough question. Who is your favorite YouTuber? Mmm. I love Trisha Paytas. Like, I love how, how out there she is and how, like, genuine she is. I don't know. I see a lot of just, like, she's such genuine and she's so honest and transparent, I feel. I don't know. Maybe that's just because, like, she puts a lot of her life on the internet. She's very, like, honest about, like, her relationships and stuff, but I think she's just funny and cute. Who is your celebrity crush? Mmm. <laughs> that's really hard. I used to have a whole bunch of celebrity crushes, but, like, ever since I started, like, now I'm in a relationship and I don't, like, focus on, like, celebrities like that anymore. Maybe it's just because I'm, like, getting older, but, like, I find a lot of, like, a lot of act actors and celebrities are very attractive, but I couldn't really pick one, like, honestly, though, like, 1991, 1990, Johnny Depp. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Like, it's always going to be Johnny Depp, but if you tell me Johnny Depp now, like, I'll have to pass because he's a lot very old, and you could tell he's aging a lot, um, but I do still love him, but no, no, it has to be, like, 1990s Johnny Depp. Alright, that's kind of all the, the questions I got. There's a few on there that I, I didn't answer, that I didn't want to answer. But, um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Actually, I, I think I eat, ate one time today and it's like 6 o'clock. So I gotta go eat more because um, I've just been, like, um, working a lot, editing a lot, and, um, yeah. But if you do want to see my covers, I do still post covers, but only on Patreon now. So you do have to join my Patreon to see my covers. I do two a month. Two a month. Two a month. And um, I'm going to be working on the next one this weekend. So I'm excited about that. It's going to be a rainy, cloudy weekend this weekend. But I'm going to work with what I got. But anyway, so yeah, my Patreon is in the link down below. And if you guys want to shop for Vina Beachwear, also the link is down there. Thank you all so much for watching. And I hope you have a great weekend or whenever you're watching this day. Love you. Bye.